After two hours of digging on Tuesday evening, part of the wreckage of the Abel Tasman was removed. Despite contractors excavating a large hole, the rest of the steel remains in the sand. With the incoming tide and light fading around 5pm, contractors gave up. The Grey District Council says they haven't made a decision on whether to have a third attempt. The Abel Tasman came to grief on the Grey Bar in 1936 and has been a stubborn wreck right from the start. 18 months after going aground, its hull was still largely intact despite constant buffeting from the waves. Darrell Baser, The South Today.